Unemployment is a serious problem in this country and in this state. In June of 2010, the unemployment rate in the state of Florida was 10.2%. Where I live, in Polk County, Florida, the unemployment rate was 12% for that same month. To those who are gainfully employed, these numbers just sound like statistics. But they are in fact people. People with a desire to work, but no opportunity. Today I'm going to talk to one such person and find out his story. He's my husband, David Geertz. Thank you for agreeing to do this interview, David. You're welcome. So David, how long have you been unemployed? Been about two years now. So what happened? Lack of work. People ain't spending the money they used to. What kind of business were you in? Flooring. I was a subcontractor. Were you eligible to receive unemployment benefits? Luckily, I was. $275 is the top weekly rate in Florida. Did you receive any assistance from the unemployment office in finding a new job? Not really. Just hand you a bunch of paper and say, look for a job. Due to dyslexia, Dave has a reading disability, and they were unable to help him. So how has this unemployment affected you as a person? as the head of a household? Well, a lot less money coming in. You get discouraged quite a bit. Wife has to bring in most of the money, so sometimes you just don't feel quite like a man. But we keep going. So what is it that you do when you're not looking for work with all the time that you have? This one way, Paul. <laughs> and just do some stuff around the house, work on the vehicles, look for more work, help some friends out. And that's about it. Ain't, ain't got money really to do a whole lot. What advice would you have for someone who is in your position as someone who's been unemployed for a while? Keep looking. Sooner or later, something's got to break. While David waits for something to break, his unemployment benefits have run out, and he's hoping that the extension gets passed by Congress soon. Twelve years of running my own business. I do commercial, residential, big jobs, little jobs, do it all. Thank you for taking time to talk to me, David. You're welcome, Teresa.